fire ball is, is based upon young 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 gentlemen being incarcerated and going into the fire into the fire program and they're lying basically they're lying to them telling them that uh, they're going to help them do, get get a lot of prom making them a lot of fake promises and at the end of the film you see as the, the young boy goes through it it gets to the end and everything they told him that he was going to receive and it was going to be is not what it was now what we say is when we do our program right here for the youth and for those that would like to participate, when you come through with us, what we say you're gonna get is what you're gonna get when you get to the end of it. It's no no sugar coating it, no, no, nothing other sort. So that's what we represent, helping those that are incarcerated, coming home, doing better, or why the end jail, they're trying to program to come home and become an active member of society, we help them do that. Help them come home and get a career in almost anything that they are interested in. So that's who we are and that's what we represent. I'm formerly incarcerated. I just got out about, I got out in May, I, been, I just did 12 years. And I'm out. Uh, the crime, uh, <laughs> it was a robbery with enhancements that they helped get rid of that no longer exists. And they're helping get rid of all of that kind of stuff to show that those who deserve a second chance could come home and had a second chance. And, I, that's, and then we continue to do it with more and more people going through it. This is Jose. And this? How old are you, Anthony? I'm 31. I left oh, at you're it. you're only 31. Yes. Like, I left. A third of your time was in prison. In prison. That's terrible. Yeah, that, it was terrible. Hi, I'm Jose Norrington. I am the development coordinator for ARC, the anti Recidivism Coalition. We are based in downtown Los Angeles. We also have an office out in Sacramento. And so, basically, our organization is here to help people that are incarcerated change their lives when they're in so that they can come out and give back to the community and change the community as well. We assist with housing, we assist with employment, we assist with training for employment, we assist with funding and mental health. Um, we love the concept of helping people inside, so we have a team of people who go into the prisons, help people change their way of life and bring them back better people, people of society, you know, worthy of having a second chance in the eyes of society.